What's going on everybody? This is uh, Herman Orquiz. I'm just gonna show you how I do one of my pours. This is the only little area that I have, you know, to make my pours, you know, working on my shot. I got the clay, duff, so what is it called, the duff clay. We're gonna go ahead and just uh, throw some of this in here. Let's see how soon I can get this done. You know, I'm glad y'all like my pores, you know, and, you know, I try my best, you know, try to get all the details, you know, I work with what I got, you know, wait for my new shot to be built. I'll have everything organized. So, I'll this to the side here, push this over, give him a little drill bit. I like to just, you know, use, you know, still my, my wife's little makeup brush, you know, she gave it to me just something extra there. I love pink, you know, so she gave it to me. You know, got to clear out these little holes here. And I guess today we're going to make some more of these little uh, survival knives that everybody really enjoyed. Throw some of this baby powder here. Just give it a little bit of sweep there. And then what we're going to do here, we're just going to go ahead and, and we'll set it right there. Push it down. Make sure we try to get it kind of even there. See how much detail we can get on this. I like to push around it. Tighten up that little spot right there. Clean up the edges a little bit. There you go. The other half will cover up the rest. There you go. All right, here's the other half right here. Set the other half. Throw a little bit of baby powder there. Some more of this sand here. Some really good uh, duff clay here. And a little bit on the pricey side, you know. Once I learn how to rejuvenate my my burnt dirt, I got probably like probably almost a five gallon bucket full of it here. Instead of me wasting my money on this, I can, you know, start reusing my own dirt. Got to use the right oil and. You know, we'll get it done. Right now, I'm just using just a piece of it's, uh, it's, uh, some of my uh, pump jacks that I make. This is part of the head here, and I just use it just to, you know, clear off, the, clear off the top. Hopefully, it came out good. We'll see. There's a the top half right there. What we're gonna do here, and then what I like to do here is just uh, knock some of this off right here, make a little funnel area, make a little little breather hole. it all the way through and I guess we can go ahead and do one right here on the edge there you go clear the little path right there knock the little bridge down so while I'm making this here we go live me in Oregon we go live sometimes golden cash on uh sundays and now you can hit up my buddy uh jc stacker he's always doing something just about every day he takes a break on sundays go to church there you go the same thing here you know i'm working on my stickers you know so i'm just haven't really decided exactly what i want to go with i'm more into pouring now you know i still stack here you know buy stuff flip it you know, but it's just, I don't know, it's just addicting when you start pouring. 
so you know i'm just learning as i go so this is just what the way i do my stuff so you know there's a lot of other people that pour you can you know watch them how they do it all right we can go like that do that piece there and then what i'm going to do here is i got that piece there i'm going to turn this upwards here I'm kind of too big but it's all I got right now so I'm just gonna go ahead and put this piece here put this piece there just just a little snug get my glove on real quick get my silver and here we go There you go. Just let it cool off. <clears throat> I like to cool mine off pretty fast. I usually don't let it set right away. Smoke, huh? Like Cheech and Chong, baby. Let's go ahead and let's get all the good dirt rubber, all the good dirt. I like to take it off right away because it pulls all your burnt dirt right away with it. If you let it cool off, it gets stuck in the mold. As you see here, nice and clean. And I like to do this, you know, live, you know, I don't do no shortcuts. I don't know where my little, my little brush is, but kind of bit my, my silver there a little bit. It's okay. It's real soft so you can bend it back. There's all the detail and everything. Let's clean out the little hole there. As you can see. Pretty good detail on it. I just have to clean it up. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed something real quick. So, yeah, guys, take it easy. You know, stay blessed, and hopefully we'll see you out there in the, the streams. Thank you. God bless.